Welcome to the Celebrity Bucket List presented by Dwayne Reed of the Walgreens family. Each week we take a celebrity, we find out what inspires and motivates them, and through their bucket list we fulfill their dreams. If I want a bucket list, this is my bucket list. <laughs> this opportunity will be the only time in our life we'll have this chance. We're here in beautiful San Diego, California at the Grand Del Mar. On this week's show, we meet super chef Michael Mina, whose bucket list revolves around a lifelong friendship. But first, let's sit down and meet Michael. What motivated you to become a chef? I started cooking when I was 15 years old, and I started primarily, it, it started for me as it, as it does for you know, many people, I think, in the United States that are chefs, talk to them about their background. It really starts as a job. I started cooking and just fell in love with the intensity of it and the creative side of it, that overall level of never being able to conquer what you're doing. And, you know, our industry is really funny being a chef. I, I think that it's really hard to ever think that you could think in one or two or even three lifetimes that you can conquer the food of the world. I think that that passion, if, if you like that, it's addictive very quickly. Chef, in all your experiences, has there been a time where you've been nervous in preparation for somebody? <laughs> well, I can honestly tell you the most nervous I've ever been cooking was for Michael Jordan. I know everybody's a Michael Jordan fan, but I can honestly say that I think I am up there as people that have been obsessed with, was just completely obsessed with him when he played basketball. And I'll never forget because I went to the table and uh, I couldn't speak. I couldn't say a word. He stood up, shook my hand, and, and I have never been, you know, to that point of just being completely speechless. So I went and cooked the meal for him. And afterwards, they invited me back out to the table. I went out to the table again and still couldn't speak. <laughs> so that, that was the worst experience ever. <laughs> when you come to a resort like the Grand Del Mar here, people assume you want to see the finest restaurant in that city that you arrive at. That aside, Michael Mina goes home. What do you prepare for yourself? Um, Your you favorite know, thing? Yeah. Uh, you know, I, I mean, I like, I really enjoy grilling. I really enjoy cooking outside. Um, we're in, in Northern California and it's just beautiful where, you know, where we are, where we, we're very fortunate to live. And so whether it's a piece of steak, a piece of fish, a burger, whatever it is, I like to cook outside. The brand of Michael Mina, what, where, where are you taking that brand? I, what I always want people to expect, what I want people to look at the brand and think about is that, you know, you're going to go into this restaurant and you're going to feel relaxed. You're going to get a very high level of food, a very high level of service. At the end of the day, the experience that I want people to have when they come into my restaurant is I want them to walk away and, you know, say that they went to a great party. They felt completely relaxed. They enjoyed everything. They felt like they looked great, which design has a lot to do with how you look in a room and how you feel in a room and those are the little details that really will make people come back to your restaurant. Of course the food has to be great and has to be innovative and and keep up with the times and everything else but that's not always enough. Coming up. When he asked me to do it I thought this was crazy you know we're too old to do this but, but like I said some of Michael's crazier ideas have always been some of the better ones right so, so uh, I think it would be something that we, uh, we remember forever. The Celebrity Bucket List is brought to you by Walgreens at the corner of Happy and Healthy, Mucinex, Mucinex in, Mucus out. Try the routine that gets your bum clean, the Cottonelle Care Routine, Lint, Chocolate Beyond Compare, Pure Leaf, Taste Like Real Brewed Iced Tea because it is. For more information and some behind the scenes footage of today's show, go to Facebook backslash The Celebrity Bucket List. 
when your worst <laughs> symptoms hit you from all sides, blame mucus. It's game time. Let's have a little fun. Nail sinus pressure. Sore throat cough combo. <laughs> Test congestion bonus. Multi symptom yes. Mucinex Fast Max Liquid relieves your worst symptoms with a mucus busting power of Mucinex and maximum strength medicines. Game's over. Mucinex in, mucus out, and now new Mucinex Fast Max Nighttime symptom relief that helps you get to sleep. Nighttime too. We can't win. Tonight I'm striking up a conversation about cleaning bums. Cannot shortchange a clean bum. Get ready for this. It's Whoa. a for your bum. So you do a bit of dry, and then a wet, and then a dry, and you're good to go. Do you think they're for girls? I think they're for everyone. I need a clean alley every time. Nothing leaves you feeling cleaner and fresher than the Cottonelle Care Routine. So let's talk about your bum on Facebook. So that's the bowling alley cleaned up. Where will we end up next? Mastering irresistibly smooth. Taste the Lindor truffle. Created with passion by Lindt's Master Chocolatiers. Like nothing you have ever experienced. When you break its shell, Lindor's smooth center starts to melt. And so will you. Smooth, flowing, luscious, chocolate beyond compare. Discover the Lindor Truffle from the Lindt Master Chocolatiers. Only the best music. Here is a track from Out of Sight. <gasps> Sorry. I don't know why, but today I feel a little bit different. Oh, I feel like I woke up this morning and I could change the world. I could change the world. I guess it's true, true, true. Yeah. Love me till my heart starts. Let's talk a little bit about your bucket list. You picked to go motocross racing with a dear friend. Yes. There's things that I did when I was young that I just, I think back on and I think to myself, wow, that was so much fun. It was so different for me back then. There was just, I was different. I didn't have a million responsibilities and we could just have real fun. And, you know, what happens when you mix children and mud? You start to have fun, right? My best friend and me, Vince, we rode together every day. Almost every single day we would go out and, and ride motorcycles and we would go get in all sorts of trouble and go ride in, you know, places because there wasn't a track where we lived, so we had to create tracks by the train tracks. and. And it was just an adventure. It was like getting to the track that you created. You had to ride illegally. <laughs> it was just this whole combination of things. And we, and we grew to be such great friends and the friendship has lasted for so many years. But it really all started because we both connected with dirt bikes and with motorcycles. Michael is, uh, Michael's been the brother I'd ever had. Um, He's, uh, he's always been there for me, and uh, if you want, I can share an experience for you, with you. It's kind of, kind of tough to talk about, but uh, September 17th, uh, 2012, I lost my daughter. Uh, passed away, and uh, it was on a Monday, and uh, he uh, had my sister call him, because at the time, I just didn't feel like talking to anybody. You know, I just, when it happened, it was just, you're overwhelmed, and you're just kind of in shock, and it's just kind of, kind of blows you away, and it's just something you're not prepared to handle, and uh, I'll, I'll never forget that Wednesday morning, uh, I got a I got a voicemail from him saying I'm here. Uh, Simon was in uh, Wisconsin. He said I'm here, and uh, you know what do you need me to do? Uh, you know, and uh, I just couldn't believe. You know, and he's got a busy schedule and had a lot going on. So uh, whatever he had going on, he put on hold, and he was there for me. And uh, so after Friday, after the viewing, uh, he he was there, and uh, you know, uh, you know he's got a gift. You know, he, he he's a hell of a chef, and. Uh, you know, he prepared food for our family, and uh, you know, people were kind of mesmerized by you know what he was able to do, and it just it kind of helped, you know, settle uh, people's feelings, and um, it was you know kind of a, a neat experience after something so tragic had happened, and uh, you know, I mean, uh, we we weren't prepared to do anything like that, you know, or were, were we able to, and uh, so you know, for him to be able to do that for us at a time like that, uh, it, you know, it meant everything to us. So it was um, pretty uh, pretty touching experience for us. 
What does tomorrow mean to you being with Michael Adam Motorbikes? Wow. Um, like I said earlier, you know, um, when, he, when he asked me to do it, I thought, this is crazy. You know, we're too old to do this. And, uh, you know, but, but like I said, some of Michael's crazier ideas have always been some of the better ones, right? Some of the funner ones. So uh, I just think it's going to be a lot of fun. I think it'll be something that we, uh, we remember forever. So I'm really looking forward to it. You guys ever think that you're going to get too old to do this? Yeah, I think we're there. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're already there. But uh, we're going to do it anyways. About 10 years ago. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I mean, I'm looking really, I, I got to say, you know, I'm really looking forward to riding. <laughs> I really am. I mean, I'm looking forward to riding with Vince. And we find a way, no matter what the situation is, to have a lot of laughs when we're together. And so I think the intensity will be great. And then I'm sure there'll be plenty of uh, new things to have laughs about by the time we're done with it tomorrow. Coming up. You guys look sharp. You got some gear ready to go. I like it. I think this is going to be interesting. Michael, did you know you put it on backwards? No. I'm already scared. <laughs> The Celebrity Bucket List is brought to you by Ageless Male, the game-changing supplement for men. SK Energy Shots, good energy. Tide Pods, pop in, stand out. Arm & Hammer, it's the clean you need. Find your strong in Saucony Footwear and Apparel. Does being over 40 make you feel like half the man you used to be? Introducing Ageless Male, a life-changing supplement for men tested to help increase testosterone levels. With over 15 million tablets sold, you owe it to yourself to find out what Ageless Male can do for you. If you would like to experience what taking Ageless Male can feel like, you really need to give Ageless Male a try and be the man you want to be. Antes de SK Energy, después de SK Energy. Señor, Colin Kaepernick, la nueva imagen de SK Energy. How you doing, Colin? No, no hablo español. Un representante que no habla español. Es el mejor futbolista del mundo. Never played this. Tú me dijiste que era el mejor futbolista del mundo. Sí, fútbol americano. symptoms hit you from all sides. Blame mucus. It's game time. Let's have a little fun. Nail sinus pressure. Sore throat cough combo. <laughs> Test congestion bonus. Multi-symptom, yes. Mucinex Fast Max Liquid relieves your worst symptoms with a mucus-busting power of Mucinex and maximum strength medicines. Game's over! Mucinex in, mucus out. And now new Mucinex Fast Max Nighttime. Symptom relief that helps you get to sleep. Nighttime too? We can't win! Tide Pods does the job of three things. It cleans, fights stains, and brightens your clothes. So all that other stuff people use in the wash doesn't really hold its weight, does it? So try Tide Pods. Why? The proof is in the pop. They may be little, but Tide Pods pack a punch. They're made of 88% active ingredients, and the competition clocks in at 13%. So with Tide Pods, you know what you get. What you get is an amazing clean. So try Tide Pods. Why? The proof is in the pop. Love me till my heart starts. All right, guys. Now, I promised a real deal. That's right. OK, so you want to have the experience. There's only one place to go. Dayton Venegas. Gentlemen. Dayton. Michael Mina. Pleasure Vince to Costello. Meet you. Vince, Dayton. nice to meet you. you. This is the real track. Dayton's the uh, owner of the track. Why don't you tell them a little bit about the experience they were in for, for today? No problem, no problem. Uh, first of all, welcome to Verona MX, uh, home of champions. We're gonna get you started on the uh, mini track, just a couple laps. After that, it's the big track. Then you're in the hands of uh, Gary the man Bailey. Right here. <laughs> Let me introduce you guys Gary Bailey, wow. legendary an instructor an for an motocross. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, good to see you guys. Gary will be your coach for the day. You got your work cut out for you today. <laughs> <laughs> Look, between Dayton and Gary, uh -huh. it's all on you then. Oh, boy. Because they got the bikes, they got the track. Right, right. 
Skills, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> the biggest goal do. for today, I think, is to make sure, have fun, that we be safe, and that you guys get to experience something that you haven't been able to do for a while. First thing they need to do is get some riding gear on. Yeah. Because I know one thing, they ain't going on ride like that. That's for sure. <laughs> All right, boys, let's go get your gear. All right. All right. You guys look sharp. We got some gear ready to go. <laughs> I like it. I think this is going to be interesting. First of all, I'm looking at the chest protector going, Michael, did you know you put it on backwards? Oh. Yeah. Oh. I'm already scared. <laughs> as soon as you get that turned around, we're going okay. to be in good shape. All right. Yeah. That feels much better. Yeah. That feels much better. OK. All right, guys, what are we waiting for? Do it. All right. <laughs> so far, how, how, how much fun are you guys having so far? <laughs> no. let, me, let me give you a couple of tips because neither one of you have been riding for a long time. Because you don't know this bike and you're unfamiliar with it, it's really a good idea if you keep one or two fingers on the clutch all the time. Okay. That way, no matter what goes wrong, you can always pull the clutch in. Okay. The other thing is about keeping your head more over the front end of the bike. Okay. Okay. When you keep your head over the front end, what you're now doing is controlling the front end of the motorcycle more. Okay. Okay. Cool. Good. Great. This racetrack is music, huh? and every racetrack is different, so it's got a different rhythm. Huh? You've got to kind of feel like dancing. You've got to kind of feel the racetrack and feel the music and go, yeah, it's kind of like when you go over this jump, there's kind of a move that happens where you kind of float over the top of it. Uh huh. So if you start feeling that, uh -huh. everything's going to change. Okay. Good job, guys. Appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, there's some good Thanks, news Coach. here. OK. The good news it. is that uh, I think we're going to move on to the big track now. Scott, what do you think about this whole thing? Coach? Thank you so much. Oh, How are yeah. you guys feeling? Great. I feel great. Yeah. I mean, I feel real good. Uh, it's amazing when you listen to what Coach has to say. It's amazing that, you know, you a few techniques. You know, how much difference. You can't, can't get competitive yet. No. Because you're on the, <laughs> the bunny slope. Yeah, the bunny yeah. Is ready to take on the big track? Absolutely. Bucket list continuing? Oh, no, yeah. Go. All right, let's do it, boys. Bump starts. Start. First time. One time. Go. Oh, yeah. It's a winner. Oh, yeah. Two winners. I love it. Big track. Coming up. The experience of getting to do something that we've wanted to do all our lives. This opportunity is not gonna happen again for either one of us. When we're here in New York City taping our show, there's only one place to get all our supplies. Dwayne Reed of the Walgreens family. Come on, let's go. You know, with my busy schedule, sometimes I need a boost of good energy that won't crash. That's why I drink SK Energy Shots. SK Energy is my good energy. SK's convenient size means I can take it on the plane to conquer jet lag and keep it in my gym bag to power through my workouts. SK has natural caffeine made from green coffee beans, so it energizes me naturally without compromising my health. 
and it tastes great too, with 100% natural flavors. No wonder SK was voted number one in energy by consumers like me. Did you know that the master chocolatiers at Lint have been making chocolate beyond compare for over 165 years? Well, if you're looking to indulge in delicious premium chocolate, try one of their most amazing creations, the Lindor Truffle. Its delicate shell and smooth melting center are irresistible. Whether you prefer the classic milk chocolate truffle or looking to try something new like Lindor Caramel, I know I'm going to pick up Lindor Milk Chocolate Truffles for my daughter Marty because it's her favorite. You know, when I'm thirsty, my drink of choice has always been iced tea. And my favorite, without a doubt, is Pure Leaf. I love the fact that they use only natural ingredients and that the tea is brewed from real tea leaves picked at their peak instead of from a tea powder. Master tea blenders pick the leaves from all over the world and fresh brew them, resulting in a much smoother, consistent taste that never disappoints. These new sleek bottles are lighter and easier to take on the go, perfect for my active lifestyle. You know, in all my travels, there's one thing I know for sure. Sickness can really put a damper on your routine. During the day, I have to work, and at night, I have to sleep. But a cold likes to make me miserable around the clock. That's why I always make sure to have some Mucinix Fast Max Severe Cold as well as their nighttime cold and flu. When I have a cold, the severe cold relieves my daytime symptoms, while the nighttime cold and flu relieves my nighttime symptoms to help me get to sleep. It's good to know that Mucinix has products that work during the day and at night. Next up on my shopping list, Tide Pods. At first, I didn't know why I wouldn't buy just any detergent, but I've learned Tide Pods make laundry easier with more satisfying results. They have the new innovative three-chambered unit dose. Pop it in the washing machine and the results are great. They clean, fight stains, and brighten the laundry. You know, more than 20% of people rewash their laundry because they're dissatisfied with the results. These Tide Pods are great. They're light and easy to use. Simply pop in and the results stand out. Tide is reliable and always on my shopping list. Dwayne Reed has brought in a real game changer for men over 40, Ageless Male, one of the most popular supplements for boosting your free testosterone levels. This formula is clinically shown to increase your free testosterone levels and support muscle health with your strength training. Plus, it boosts your sexual drive and performance, which is a good thing. And with an added vitamin to give you more energy, Ageless Male is truly the game-changing must-have for guys. You know, when I travel, I look for certain brands that I feel are good and safe. That's why when I'm here at Duane Reed, I always buy Cottonelle. Buying Cottonelle Fresh Care Flushable Wipes and Cottonelle Ultra Comfort Care Toilet Paper is a must for comfort and freshness. Cottonelle Fresh Care Wipes comes in a variety of packages like the tubs or refills and a new upright dispenser with a non-skid base that prevents movement and sliding and a moisture lock seal to keep cloths fresh. You know, your mom always told you her secret was baking soda. Today, with Arm & Hammer toothpaste and laundry detergent, it's easier than ever to get clean and fresh. So fight stains and whiten both your teeth and your favorite shirt. Arm & Hammer, it's the clean you need. Love me till my heart starts. All right, Dayton, what do we have? Well, at first I'd like to congratulate the guys on uh, graduating from the mini track <laughs> to the big track. The reason Verona calls itself home of champions is a lot of the top riders have been out of here. Jeremy McGrath, Ryan Hughes, Ronnie Lachine, all, all top prospects out of this place. So you guys should be real proud of yourself. Schiff, what's your expectations today? Well, I can say one thing for sure. All those great riders that you said came off of this course, their jobs are safe. <laughs> <laughs> All right, boys, take it out there. All right. So far, they haven't missed any turns, so that's good news. That's a good sign. Yeah. Of course, they have the teacher to credit for that, right? Yeah. yeah.
Vince and me have, have had a relationship um, since we were 10 years old where we could, at the end of the day, at the end of a month, at the end of a year, whatever it's been, whatever blocks of time we've been apart, we can just pick up from wherever we were. When you have somebody that you truly call your best friend, you call a lot of people your best friend, but Vince to me is my best friend. I think of Vince because, I think of him because he was my first real best friend. And more than anything else, when I want to just unlock from what I do on a day-to-day -day basis, there's nobody I'd rather be with than Vince. You know, whatever it is, he always tries to make me part of it. You know, if I, if I want to be a part of it, you know, when he opens up restaurants, he say, you know, he'll say, hey, I got this going on. If you uh, you want to come down for the opening, you know, uh, you're more than welcome. You know, he's taking me to a couple of Super Bowls. Uh, you know, he's taking me to the NCAA Final Four. Uh, so you know, there's, he's always uh, he's always he's just really giving, right? And he's always just uh, always been able to create experiences. You know that um, you know that, that most people don't get to experience. And uh, you know, without him, I you know I wouldn't have these experiences. So. Uh, it's, uh, it's, it's been a nice gift. The whole experience of spending a few days together and spending some time together and exposing both of us to something uh, on the racetrack that we always wanted when we were kids. And in all honesty, we couldn't afford it. We didn't have the ability to just go ride on a professional track. And so I think that the experience of getting to do something that we've wanted to do all our lives um, and have never been able to do it for multiple reasons. And when you approached me about doing this and we started talking about it, I started thinking about it. And I was like, if I don't do it this time, we'll never do it. It'll never happen. Like th this, uh, this opportunity is not gonna happen again for either one of us. All right, boys, how you feeling? Oh. Exhausted. You're exhausted? <laughs> good. Great. I didn't do any of the work you did. You're feeling good, though? I feel great. Thank you. I feel great. Coach Gary, thank you so much for Gary, coming thank over. Thank you. Gary yeah. Bailey, the legendary thank coach. Thank you. A lot of fun. Dayton <laughs> Venegas in the um, Verona Motocross. Pleasure, Thanks pleasure. so much for hosting us out here. No problem, anytime. Boys, the bikes, the day, yeah. sunny weather, Grand Del Mar at night. Great. You guys had a pretty good. Uh, Bucket list, can you check it off? Check it off, Scott. Thank you very much. My pleasure. This is a real pleasure. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Well, Appreciate thank it. You. Appreciate it. Thanks you can for check watching. <laughs> you can check that off, and we'll see you next week on the Celebrity Bucket List. His head was forward and I was going to go, that's good. And as soon as he got to the middle, he got back and he hit the gas. Just talk about it. Just look at there. <laughs> look at there. Look at there. Look at there. You're all fixed, dude. Yeah. As soon as you get that turned around, we're going to okay. make a check. Thanks a lot, Gary. <laughs> you cook at home at all? <laughs> uh, yes. You yes. do? Yes, I do. I'm going to come to your house when you're cooking next time. <laughs> I got some tips for you. <laughs> <laughs>